Ah, Heidelberg. The romance and the cute little alleyways. But this picturesque university city is not only populated by tourists and students. It's also home to industry and plenty of high-tech jobs. Family-run company Prominent Group is based here. It employs over 2,000 worldwide, and 600 of them are in Heidelberg. The company is a global leader in its sector, thanks in part to Rainer Dulge, son of the founder and chief technology officer. He's the kind of executive who's interested in the details. We make solenoid metering pumps. They're used for the precise addition of chemicals in the production of disinfectants, flavorings or coloring. It all happens with these little pumps here. They're our main product. He's now also president of Gesamtmetall, the federation of German employers associations in the metal and electrical engineering industries. That means negotiating collective agreements for thousands of firms. This is where employers negotiate with unions about pay and working hours. It's a good thing, better than in many countries in Europe where the government gets involved. Collective bargaining works. For the 2013 round of wage negotiations, we'll again find a feasible solution for companies and unions. At stake are the wages of three and a half million people across Germany. What do his own firm's workers say? Do they want more money? Who doesn't? Of course. How much? Well, four or five percent would be okay. A couple of percent? A few percentage points? Two or three percent wouldn't be bad. Gabriele Dierhoff Kaiser is responsible for communicating those hopes and expectations to the union and the management. Her boss's rapid rise means she's become one of the best known Works Council chairwomen in the country. It means more is expected and demanded of me as well. It raises the bar considerably for me. So she's risen along with him. I might never quite reach the heights he's reached, but basically, yes. <laughs> She's had many meetings with Dolga, not all of them easy. If production needs to be stepped up to meet an order deadline, any extra weekend and night shift work has to be first negotiated with her. I grew up with this company. My father founded it. I've been on the job for around 30 years now, which means knowing what a mid-sized firm needs. I think that knowledge qualifies me for a position like Confederation President. He's an employer who understands the kind of calculations involved in mid-sized businesses, including wage costs. There have been a series of big pay increases in the metal and electrical engineering industries in recent years. An average annual wage of over 48,000 euros means this is a sector with top earners. And we're sure to find a sensible way of remaining at the top of German industry in the future. Prominent is one of the biggest employers in Heidelberg. If its wages go up, the city prospers as well.